What's up guys, today we have an unboxing courtesy of the folks over at Upper. Now they did send these out to me for free, but just to give my opinions on the products and unbox them for you today. Now, if you like any of the products that you see in today's video, there's Amazon affiliate links in the description down below, which you can use to support the channel. So in the box, we have the ghost paper screen cover, which I'm most excited for, but more on that later on. We also get a bunch of stickers. And then there's the first of their Nimble collection. Now this is the Nimble Grip for the Apple Pencil. We then have the Nimble Stand. And finally, we have the Nimble Sleeve. Now let's get these unboxed. Now starting with the sleeve, opening up the box, we'll find our sleeve inside this plastic casing. This is an all round sleeve for the Apple Pencil, given both the grip and the protection at the same time. Now, one question you might have is whether or not you need to take this on and off each time. The answer is no. It magnetically still connects to the iPad and still charges, which is awesome. Now, when I was adding this on, I did find it a little bit tricky and it does take a little bit of persuasion to get into position, but once it's on, it really isn't going anywhere. Now this was quite the surprise as I've used grips like this in the past, but I have to say it felt great in the hand. It's nice and grippy, nice and soft, and I'm actually gonna be leaving this on for a while. If you don't want a full sleeve, there is a more traditional grip, which we have here with the nimble grip. Now this will need to come on and off as you'll be able to see, as you won't be able to charge the Apple Pencil with this on. The grip itself is very nice to the touch and shares the same rubbery sort of feel as the full sleeve. It has two different styles on either end. The bottom is rounded and curves out to give your finger and thumb somewhere nice to rest. And then it swoops off at the top into this nice hexagonal design, more so for styling, I presume. Now this is very much on par with the other grips that I have, and I'll try to pop it into a rotation with the full sleeve. Now moving on, we have the nimble stand, a pretty straightforward stand that you can place on your desk and is a nice holder when you need to take a break. It also follows suit with the same soft rubber feel around the outside and also has a pretty good weight to it as well. So it won't be moving much on your desk. But then we move on to the product I'm most excited to see. And this is the Ghost Paper Screen Cover. This is another matte screen cover for the iPad. There's many out there and every company does it in a different way. So it's always good to see their approach to it. In the box, you get a screen cover and a bag of tools, which you're going to need to install the cover. The first is an installation card, which has a super handy QR code on it, which actually links off to a web page where they've given you step by step instructions to install the cover, followed by some cleaning wipes, some stickers for holding the screen in place while you're applying it. The installation was very traditional for this type of thing, very straightforward, and the web guide is super easy to follow. You'll need to start off by cleaning your iPad first and giving it a good wipe down. You'll need to align it to the screen and then hold it in place with the guide stickers. Remove any lint from the screen before peeling it off, and that is the first film and pressing it down onto the iPad. You'll just need to squeeze out any bubbles and their nice little card here has actually a little cutout in the corner so you can use that and then remove the extra additional film on the top. Now I have to say that the ghost paper is actually packed full of texture. It's pretty hard for me to portray on the camera, but it's really nice matte feel and it's going to provide a bunch of friction while you're drawing to give you that sort of paper feel. Now take a listen to this ASMR. Now that's been my first look and unboxing of the ghost paper cover, nimble stand, grip and sleeve from Upper. I'll be leaving the ghost paper on and bouncing between the grip and sleeve for a little while before giving my final review. So stay tuned for that. If you have any questions on any of the products in today's video, drop them in the comments down below and you might be featured in the full review. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.